Sauvignon Garage Barbecue. Today we're we'll doing some Portuguese pork. We call it blade meat. We're gonna make some kick-ass sandwiches with it. We're gonna do it in a cast iron. We're gonna do it on a little pit boss. You ready to do this? Let's go. All right, I got a four pound boneless pork butt. It's gonna cube this up. Get the pieces pretty much that size there. Like that, that's good. I'm gonna get the rest of this cubed up. We'll be back when we got marinade. We'll be right back. All right, let's get our marinade going. I'm gonna be throwing four envelopes of this Goya Saison. That one there, which is right here, into the bowl. About four tablespoons of regular paprika. Now I got this hot chopped peppers. You can use crushed red pepper if you don't have this. I'm gonna go about four tablespoons maybe, five. Some apple cider vinegar. About four tablespoons roughly. I got two cups of water here. I'm gonna start off probably about a cup or so. And I'm gonna hit it up with uh, two, about two tablespoons of tomato paste. This pepper here is hot. Hot scalding her, but got some flavor to it. Let's just whisk this up a little bit here. I'm gonna add a little bit more of that water now. Give me about a one and three quarter cups of water. this a quick little taste go on with a little bit more probably about two tablespoons of this crushed pepper we're gonna be hitting this up later when it goes into our pan with Chopped up garlic, onions, some beer. Yeah. It's gonna come out pretty damn good. I'm gonna take all the taste of this thing. It's good right there. We'll get our pork over that I cubed up. Just get my hand in there and mix that up nicely. I'm gonna put this in my Tumbler vacuum. If you don't have one, Ziploc bag it. Let it sit a minimal, minimal of 24 hours. The longer it sits, the better it's gonna get. I'm gonna put this in a vacuum tumbler, tumble it, throw it in the fridge, probably for about an hour, hour and a half. But that's what we're looking, looking for right there. We'll be back. Dutch oven up on open flame there. I'm gonna get a couple tablespoons of butter, probably about four down in it. I got about a half of a large Vidalia onion that I sliced up there. We got four cloves of garlic that I minced up. Just gonna 
stir these around here a little. Let them cook up for a few minutes. I'm gonna let it go for about five minutes or so. We'll be back. All right, we're back. We've been stirring right along. They're getting a little bit translucent. Pull this back a little bit here. We're gonna get our pork that we've been vacuum sealing, release the pressure. We're just gonna dump that right in. smell coming off this already is crazy. You can pick up that pepper, that garlic. Whew. This is gonna be a good one. I'm gonna let this go for a few minutes here. On that burner like that. I'm gonna come back, I'm gonna add some beer into this. We're gonna shut that afterburner off, slide it over to the side. We'll be back. All right, we're back. Get a nice little simmer running there. We're gonna get our beer in now. I'm using Bud Light. Best one for this would be probably regular Budweiser Red. I ain't got it, this is all I had in the beer fridge. So that's what's going in. Give that a stir. This will add a little bit of flavor to it. You want it barely covering the top, which is right about where we are there. I'm gonna slide this over. I got this running at 400 right now. Close the afterburner. I'm gonna throw a lid on it. When I use this one in this, I gotta take the handle off. It doesn't fit, because it's too low. Just cover that. Let it rip. We'll be back a little while to check on it. We'll be back. All right, we're back. It's been about four hours. Came out earlier, took the lid out. This is done. This is full of hot done. Pull this out, let it cool for a few. We'll be back, we'll plate this up. All right, let's get our blade meat sandwich going. We got our Portuguese bread, a popsuk, cut in half. Get some of our blade meat right on top. Get some of our fire roasted Portuguese hot peppers rolling right up on top of that. And then we'll just lit it off. Let me just bring it down here. And there you go. It's a Portuguese bleed meat sandwich. Marinated pork, 
some fire roasted hot Portuguese peppers. And I'll tell you what, I've been munching on this meat for the past hour. I didn't even have to bite this one. I know it's good. Thanks for watching.